Simon Jack Muldoon's stoppage time penalty has given us all three points tonight against Bromley. It came in dramatic circumstances, but is that what we deserve tonight? Yeah, definitely. Um, I mean, to be honest, the, the away game at, at Bromley, we didn't deserve anything out of it that day, and, and we did, but uh, I think it, it was a contrasting performance this time, and we really did deserve the three points. We, we created a lot of chances. The ball just didn't bounce for us in the area, but we kept doing what we were good at. Thought we had a good ba uh, balance of physicality and, and football, and the decision making, and, and more importantly, t the team ethic was outstanding tonight. You mentioned after the game on Saturday being deflated, conceding the late goal. It must be the polar opposite of emotions tonight. Yeah, hundred percent. But whilst we were deflated, we you've got to brush it off quickly. And I think with this group we can because they um, they, they, they visualise doing well in the end of the season, and and so therefore we understand there's, there's going to be ups and downs between now and the end of the season. And you've just got to be calm, whether it's in the disappointment of the other day and get back on it on Monday, which was which was really good response yesterday in training to. Um, even now, in the euphoria of winning the 94th minute, you enjoy it, but tomorrow we'll, you know, we'll be buzzing, but we've got to stay calm again and not get ahead of ourselves. We're, we're six now, um, but it's important we, uh, we build on tonight. It's a second clean sheet in three games. We came so close to claiming one as well on Saturday. Just how pleased were you with the defensive aspect of tonight? Yeah, the last three games, it's been so much better defensively. Compare that to the Ebbs Fleet performance where we looked likely to concede. Um, every time it went forward, but credit to the players who are playing right now. You know, the, we stuck um, stuck with that 11 now for three games, and they've all responded. The team dynamic and mentality has been out, outstanding and strong. You know, you're going to get disappointments, but it's how you pick yourself up and how strong are we? You know, uh, compared to a few weeks ago, well, I think a lot stronger. Um, just got to keep seeing the job through, and and that's why I, I kept the 11 on because they all look fresh. They all looked adamant that it was going to be their night and um, you know, there were a lot of shouts around the dugout, make changes, take him off, take him off, but I thought they were all playing superbly well and, and um, I think it was justified in the end. The 11 you chose certainly seemed to create a lot tonight. We hit the post twice on another night. Could it have been a few more? Yeah, it could have been quite a few more, but you know it really doesn't matter now. We can enjoy... Um, when it mattered, Jack Muldoon stepped up and was the big man for us again and in terms of big man for the big occasion. Um, as a partnership, that's as good as I've seen at this level this season. Uh, I thought Becky was just, he's got better and better and, and Jack Muldoon's energy wears people down. And As a team, that's what we've got to be like now. We've got to be dogged and we've got to wear people down. Uh, and that's both in physicality and, and in mental strength. You know, we've just got to keep going, keep going, keep going. And as you can see, there's an outpouring of emotion from both teams after. Probably frustration a lot with the referee and, and then obviously the last minute winner on both sides of the coin you've got high emotions but that's all gone. I think they've got uh, a good manager, good guy, you know, and um, uh, you know, I, I wish them well.